a library has prepared a relocation. They had to move a lot of books, but they lacked budget and manpower. It was the person in charge of the library who was more concerned than anyone else. He thought day and night about how to move books by reducing expenses. Then one day, he saw his six-year-old son struggling to lift the apple box. The child seemed to give up because he thought she could not move the box, but suddenly changed his mind and moved back and forth forty times with each apple in his hand. At that moment, he realized that dividing a big problem into small pieces could solve it. So he temporarily removed the limit on the quantity of books rented by residents. Instead, he had them return the books they borrowed to the new library. Residents borrowed as many books as they wanted to read and returned them to the new library. Thanks to this, the library saved effort and saved money. This story is one of the examples of good use of dividing among creative idea, thinking. Don't you think of good ideas? If so, try to think about whether there is a way to divide the work into small pieces, like this case. Thank you.